Let's check out some of the new things we've got as well. We've already got seven Chocobo armlets. That's kind of insane. Ah, Feather Cap. Increases parameter break by up to three times. Triple limits. What the hell? As if we don't get enough already. I feel like this is just <laughs> this is just really breaking shit right now. Let's just let's just keep it like this for now. Let's not get too excited. I think we're more than ready to just get out there and start kicking ass. But I think when something like regen gets mastered, everything just sort of transforms it. I feel like this might be worth it at this stage, Dark Fire Arga. With the magic plus seven, I think I might do that. But yeah, most of these I just haven't picked up enough at this stage, but these are just kind of instant. Nice. Just do one at a time. Let's fuse this. I think for now I'll, I'll leave it at this. I do have Dark Fire Raga and Hell Blizzard if I want it as well. So I think we're covering a decent amount of things here. Don't have Blizzard, but I think we can probably make it by. I'm trying to see if I can gain a few more um, stars for some of this stuff. All right, let's push on. Start playing as slightly more grown-up Zack. Activating combat mode. Taking you down a peg. Take that. How about this? Wow, that was a good little comeback. Oh yeah. Let's try a dark fire raga here. Oof. Got him. Got him. Ah, choke by mode. Bring it out Let's stop guns. these guys. It's been a while since we triggered that one. Four thousand six hundred. Physical, nice. By now, this is gonna sting. How about this? That's enough. Taking you down, this is gonna sting. Conflict result. Oh, yeah. Yeah, of course, all of that work that we did in the missions is showing up here. That's going to be a bit of a common theme. Genesis? No, a copy. The gunplay does look dope though, I have to say. And we did get the magic pot, nice. Let's mug an item. <laughs> okay. 
Oh, that's how it works. Nice. <laughs> okay. There I was thinking he was going to steal something on our behalf. Professor Hollander has escaped. What? They already hit us upstairs? No, but security was spread thin after the attack, and he used that opportunity to escape. He escaped? On his own? Yes. It's as if he knew an attack was about to occur. It's possible that he received some outside help. Where is he? Are there any leads? Cameras in the sixth level of Upper Junon have a positive ID on Hollander. We're on the sixth level of Lower Junon, so he should be somewhere up ahead. To go to Upper Junon, go through the Central Passageway Gate and go straight. Press the switch to operate the gate. All right. You look after the wounded. Sir! As for Hollander, leave him to me. Okay, back the way we came. So look at this. Simultaneous attacks. Zack, where are you? Soldier operatives are being sent out because we're getting attacked from all over the place. I'm on a chopper myself, on my way to an assignment. You were on vacation, weren't you? Did it get cut short? These recent attacks may spell real trouble for us. What's worse, the chain of command is in shambles since Director Lazar suddenly disappeared. Nobody seems to know where anyone is. Yeah, it's, pre it's got pretty wild there. How many copies did they make? Activating combat mode. Ah, oh, I thought I could get the final hit in. I think maybe this chapter will go a bit e bit more easily, but I think once I get to chapter 7, it'll start to re-equalize again. Hollander! You won't get away! Come on, man! Stop pestering me! Activating combat mode. Alright, here it is again. I mean, I'm not even using, like, gravity and stuff at the moment. I could use that as well. Oh, yeah. I have to say, with the older look, the Buster Sword, and well, obviously all the work that we've been doing and his ability and stuff, he's looking much more like a first class now. I have to say. Hollander! Quickly throw to save him. Yeah, I agree. Still got hit somehow. Right, can we just get in, please? I've done this like 600 times. <laughs> That's a real mech right there. A new model? Yeah. Just you wait, Hollander. Activating combat mode. I wonder if 
this will still, even if it's not um, Thundaga. Then again, Thundaga might still hit multiple enemies. Nah, I don't think so. Well, it can, but fine. Yeah, I don't think we're going to poison this machine very easily. But that's easy enough to dodge. That was harsh. Ah, not quite. It was a bad time where I needed to heal there. So that's what it does. Okay, fine. Yeah, that was just a really annoying combination there. But not doing a lot of damage here, considering, like, how... Thousand. Whoa, I got blasted, man. But I'm a bit disappointed by how little damage Thundog is doing. I'm not happy with that. Activating combat mode. And that time, actually, my DMW was pretty shit. I got, like, nothing. Doesn't always work, of course. MP up, gotten stronger. I'm feeling it. Just have to remember there is potential to get hit by about 3,000 damage. Bringing out the big guns. So you see already a very different attempt to the previous one. But this one, I mean, it's living up to its name. It is a tank. Come on. One more. <laughs> God's sake. Always just get away with it. Yeah, it's a bit unlucky. All right, back to you, buddy. This will do. This is gonna sting. How about this? That's enough. Yeah, when I'm not using uh, Thundog, it's not working so well. So yeah, well, so much for being like really OP at this stage. We're definitely not, so that's also a good sign. I'm kind of happy about that. I was a little bit worried. Uh, just a lot of interruption here. And it strung those back to back. So yeah, definitely not a boss to be underestimated here. Just taking too many hits. I think I can grind it down like this, but it will take a bit of time. And I mean, there's no evidence that it's weak to Thundaga at all, really. This time I did a little better. Do need an ether though. Yeah, targeting sometimes a bit. So I'm going to hang a little bit here until I get some limit break stuff. It's coming. Zante Suka level 2. Oh. First time. 
can it do it against this machine? Oh yeah. I really like the design of this Odin. So badass. I really hope this works. It would be kind of lame if it didn't. <laughs> yeah. That's some good shit. It was just tanky and boring anyway. Forget this guy. Glad it ended that way. This area has mostly been cleared. We'll lock the gate and make this a place of refuge. Making progress, huh? As for me, I still haven't secured Hollander. Gotta move. Yes, understood. Yeah, it definitely needs more uh, Reno and Root. My boys, Consul and Luxier. Haven't arrived at my post yet. Could the director's absence be be having this much of an impact on the operation's lack of finesse? By the way, how was the beach? You looked awfully stressed out before you went. Did the waves and the sun help you at all? Soldier members are being deployed in response to the simultaneous attacks that have been hitting everywhere. I'm mailing you from the helicopter that's taking me to my assignment. By the way, I just heard about what you told the rookies on your first mission after you changed your hairstyle. Embrace your dreams, and whatever happens, Protect your soldier honor. I was so moved when I heard this. It's been my personal motto ever since. I'm following you until the end, Zach. And he's becoming more of a leader as well. Like I say, he's really starting to feel more like a first class kind of guy. That grunt there, he got air sick. Man, as if we don't have enough problems already. We haven't had as much chance to talk to NPCs for a while, so let's take a little breather. Mr. Soldier, please do something! You know, I just saw Cisne heading to the 8th level of Upper Juno. First an assault on Midgar, and now there's trouble in Juno? I have to say, this hasn't been a good year for Shinra. I'll rendezvous with Cisne and continue the evacuation. You keep pursuing Hollander. Wow, it's a spectacle! She's enjoying herself, okay. Huh? What's the commotion? <laughs> Are they shooting a movie or something? And the last guy. You there! Have you any idea what Junon's annual budget is like right now? We're in the red as it is. Get rid of these monsters at once! Okay. I think we can keep going. Love the way Odin swooped in, got it done. But there's different levels of it as well, so maybe it's almost like a Final Fantasy X Zanmato resistance. That way is the airbase. He's trying to get away by air? No way. <laughs> come, come, come. <laughs> I wonder what happens to Juna if you can't stop them, hmm? Ah, damn it! He's destroying the gate to attack the civilians. Hollander, once I catch you, I'll deck you good! Yeah, Final Fantasy VII's entire story really has been about the scientists, man. The weapons Hollander used to escape are now headed to the evacuation area. Destroy them before they can bring harm to Junon's residence. You can initiate battle with the weapons by coming in contact with the enemies. Make sure you destroy all the weapons. Okay. Sure. Activating combat mode. Ah, I thought I could get there first. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah. Combat mode. Yeah, one of these and then bang bang. Easy. Oh, yeah. Activating combat mode. Oh. Conflict resolved. Oh yeah. So no problem for these guys. Activating combat mode. 
Here we go. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, yeah. Oh, Dark Fire Raga Don't goes up. Result. Perfect. Oh, the fast. Heads up. This is going to sting. Well, can you use a gravity oh, spell? Yeah. That's dangerous. Do. Love this. If there's a pack of them and they start busting out gravities, oh, that yeah. could be a problem, but for now we're okay. Activating combat mode. But yeah, I can just Don't do this. Okay. You get enough MP back that it's not a problem. Activating combat mode. Bring it on! Oh, yeah. You always get at least 40% MP back when that happens. Activating combat mode. So it gives you plenty of room to just... But you have to make sure you don't get hit. Continuing the no damage streak. Activating combat mode. Ah, took a hit there. First hit I've oh, taken all out. during this entire thing, basically. It's time to take damage now. I should have waited. I had a chance for a limit break there, but good enough. All right, that's all of them. Hollander, you'll pay for this. Yeah, Sephiroth, man, what is he up to? Okay. Uh, optional thing in there. was a little worried about you, but I guess you have things under control. Nice work, Cisne, and fast, too. You'll make Turk's supervisor in no time. Well, we'll see. It's a compliment. Just accept it. Once you're promoted, I'll throw you a party. I've never even thought of being celebrated by someone. Huh? I was raised to believe that initially, everyone I meet is an enemy. But, I recently stopped believing that, thanks to my Turks colleagues. Hey, Sisne. What did you do before you joined the Turks? You're like the youngest Turk I've met. I was in training for a long time. Then I joined the Turks right after. No, enough chit chat. It's about time we get back to work. Hey, hold on, Cisne. If you keep slacking off, you're going to disappoint your fans. Fans? Of me? <laughs> Look into it. When you're back in Midgar, apparently there's a whole lot of people cheering for you. My fans, huh? I wonder what they're like. <laughs> He's so ready to have a fan base. And he does. But yeah, Cisne gave away nothing about her backstory there. It's a bit of a shame. Like I said, that's one area that this game so far is is okay, but it's not it's not setting the world alight. 
Okay. Now we really can move on. The game's done an incredible job of keeping you on this particular platform for ages. <laughs> I'll give you a hint, here we go. If you can't get these fans of yours out of your head, I suggest you visit headquarters. Whoever knows the most about company goings on just might make something about a few of them. Makes sense, doesn't it? I mean, we know we've at least got one fan. That's Cloud. gonna fight here. Scorpion types? Hollander's too well connected. Activating combat mode. Prototype guard scorpion, that's dope. Okay, did not take a lot of damage there. Obviously gonna be immune to, to most of what I throw at it. Yeah, and I gotta not get hit by that. Alright, nice big critical there, followed up by this. It's a pretty nice chunk of damage. But as you can see, not doing that great. Again. Okay. Just not quite getting the timings on point here. But we will. Here we go. Definitely a big step up though from most of what we've been fighting. Yeah, I didn't roll. Another off to smash. Concentrate. I'm feeling it. Yeah, even level two is not too bad. This is a beefy boy, I have to say. Okay, try to squeeze in the lucky stars there. You can do it, Zach. 75. I do have 6,900 HP. Let's see if it's enough. Oof. That's a big hit. Taking you down a bit. No, you don't. This'll do. Gonna love this. You've seen the criticals work in there. Okay, no MP cost means that. Ah, oh, one too many. Oh. 
Murderous Thrust. Let's go. See this one for the first time. <laughs> okay. 5,600. Grinding it down, this is again like a good level challenge, so I'm very glad I haven't ended up becoming super OP and I just didn't blast this one out. I think for random encounters we're we got things sorted, but Hey, Zach? Hmm. That thing where you yeah, okay. Whoa. Level five. Good luck. Thanks. Got me absolutely smashed it with that. Yeah, come on. Come on. Come on. There it is. Screw you. Oh, I thought I avoided that. Nice. 